United States military forces continue their attack against militant group Islamic State, or ISIL. Officials say more than 150 airstrikes have been conducted across Iraq since last month. What the U.S. president called a counter-terrorism strategy is now being referred to as a war. In the same way that we are at war with al-Qaeda and its affiliates around the globe, we are at war with ISIL. But make no mistake, when I say we, I'm not talking just about the United States. I'm talking about this broader international coalition that includes Sunni-led governments in the region uh, and our allies around the world. Happy to see you. No firm commitment to the coalition yet from Turkey, even though it shares long borders with both Syria and and Iraq and is one of Washington's main allies in the region. Also missing from the list of countries backing the military campaign, Iran. I'm comfortable that this will be a broad-based coalition with Arab nations, European nations, with the United States, others. No one has called me and asked me uh, uh, with respect to uh, uh, the presence of Iran. Uh, but I think under the circumstances at this moment in time, uh, it would not be right for any number of reasons. One Arab country that is in the coalition, Saudi Arabia, has promised to provide training camps for moderate Sunni fighters from Syria.